Hello everybody, Eminent Storm here, and welcome back to Victoria to the Macedonian Empire. In the last episode, we continued our project of expanding the size of our military, and we also got some technology that improved our ability to colonize. So we got some more colonies up here in uh, Canada, and we also got expanded some colonies in here. We're in a fight with the Aztecs for this region here, which I would really like to get, but I don't think I'm going to be able to um, because I didn't quite pay close enough attention and they got a, quite a lead on us. But we're going to try. Um, July 11th is when we can hit this again. So let's actually just unpause it. Let's just get to July 11th real quick. Seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, and hit it, and when can we do this again? October 9th, so we're going to have to keep an eye on that. Alright, we're going to continue our work on getting the military expanded. Uh, we got another army building up here. Um, actually, we could probably, yeah, we can gather these two, oh, these guys can merge. That's all artillery. Well, and that's all artillery. How did that happen? How did that happen? Okay, that's goofy. Um... We need to get those infantry divisions some, uh... I mean, those, these, this artillery, some infantry. Um, we probably actually need to go ahead and split this up a little bit. And split this up. Well, artillery is indeed powerful. Having nothing but artillery is not exactly a good idea. Alright, so... Uh, let me look at my recruitment map mode. Ah, we got some, some area here we can recruit from. Okay, so let's set... Let's set this as a rally point. And let's give infantry, 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 some engineers, some cavalry, some cavalry, some cavalry, and some cavalry. There we go. This army, I actually probably push them towards the front. Uh, where could we stack 40 some odd divisions? Not divisions. Regiments, I guess you would call it in this game. We're not in the Hearts of Iron yet. I'll bring them over here. Uh, 36,000 troops. Oh, that's not even regiments. It's 42,000 troops. Those are actual numbers. Uh, let's see. We need... Supply limit. There we go. Ah, there we are. You guys can come up there. Oh, that's... Is that... Oh, that is nice. I like this map mode. But if I select an army, like this guy, it tells me where they can sit without taking attrition. Isn't that nifty? Alright. So we need to work in on fleshing out these armies. Um... Now, one thing is our infamy is coming down. Oh, we got these guys.
Um, probably actually want to, because these guys aren't really that useful sitting here in the middle of India. Uh, so I'm going to actually move them. If I go to my, where was it? Region, revolt risk, colonial recruitment. Supply limit, there we are. Alright, so you. You can park over there. You can park over here. Do we have any more recruitment going on? Can't remember. Normally I'll see like a little icon of a guy working if we were building anything. What is this actually? Just infantry. Okay. So let's actually send them some engineers. Some... Cavalry. And perhaps a couple of... Artillery. There we go. Alright, so that's up to strength mostly. Oh, this guy needs to get pushed back up to the front. Oop, strategic mobility. We finished. Oh, it's October. Get that in there. When's this? Uh, January 21st. Okay. Okay, so we need a new tech uh, before let too much time pass by. Uh, what do, what can we get? What can we get? Uh, culture, positive. Inorganic chemistry, supply limit plus 25%. That sounds nice. Mining output, farming output. Iron, muzzle loaded artillery. Increases supply consumption of artillery. Military statistics. Uh, so much to do. Uh, let's go ahead and get the iron muzzle loaded artillery. Start the research on that. Actually, let's just slow down, slow things down here a little bit. Norse Empire accepted the Christ offer from Australia, or Australia, not Australia. Um, white piece. Okay, Ooh. and we can we can create a colony there. We can bring it all the way up to colony level. We can bring that up to state level. Excellent. All right, what's the newspaper say? Price is averted. Lang Shang feels our might, and they better because we're going to be absorbing them not too much longer from now. Uh, fast research complete. Georgia research complete. Okay. All right. Now I did actually do one thing before I started up the recording here tonight. Is I went and I tested to see what would happen if I pushed myself over twenty-five infamy. Um, and we're getting. Almost to the point where we are strong enough that no one will mess with us. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's get the research points. Um, and even if someone does mess with us, our army is powerful enough to fight them. Because the containment wars are not that hard to win. A few big victories in the field. Maybe take a province or two. And you can piece it out. So we're almost to the point here where we're just going to basically ignore the infamy counter and just go do whatever we want. And if anybody wants to get in our way, we'll just knock them over. 
Uh, oh, explosives factory is closed. Let's go ahead and open that back up. Uh, actually, let me look through my factories here. Um, this machine parts factory can get expanded. This lumber mill can be expanded. A liquor distillery in Bulgaria. They're near their employee limit. Upgrades all factories of this type. Upgrades all factories which are near their employee limit. If I shift click, upgrade all factories. 33 factories. Ooh, let's see what happens if I do that. Will my budget go in the tank? Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. It took a bit of a hit there, but we're okay. I think we got some capitalist investment. Okay, it's December 7th. I think what we really need to do is we need to get these, these armies taken care of here. Alright, so... Wasn't there more artillery that was being built? Hmm, guess not. Alright, you guys... Have you park over there. I'm gonna actually bring... One of those guys over there, because that is one of our rally points. And we want to get them some infantry. Infantry, some engineers and some cavalry, because we don't actually need them. We don't actually need to build any artillery, we just need to add all the other stuff. Still got a lot of unemployment. Uh, 1180 and Piedmont. I think Piedmont is over here, isn't it? What is it? Uh, PIEM. Piemonte. Oh, it's this it's actually the whole uh the whole region. Okay, so we got lots of unemployed in this region. So what's the RGO here? Um RGO is fruit. Fruit. Fruit is used to make wine. Let's see. This our top three imported goods are coal. Timber and liquor. Oop, that's not what I'm gonna do. Wow, there's like all kinds of factories in those states. Oh, we can't build factories? Oh, I think because I I know what it is. We switched to the Conservative Party, which as interventionalism, which lets us upgrade factories, but doesn't let us build them. We need to switch it back over to the National Party. There we go. Now that should let us do what we want. Eh, yep. Okay, so... If we go to liquor... Liquor uses grain. It's wine that uses... fruit. Uh, what else would use fruit? Not ammunition.
Uh, canned food? Nope, oh, can't build it. Probably we already have one here. I wonder if there's an easy way to see... Oh, January, hold on. January 21st, okay. So... Fourteen, fifteen. I don't know if we're going to be able to win this. Help feed the local poor. We're going to keep adding it in because we got the points. Oh, and these guys. Move them back to the front. This guy should be moving. Oh, when was the the next point we can put in there? Uh, April twenty first. Okay. Where do you? Do we have? Anywhere where we're actually making coal? That's wood. Uh, that's not in my territory, is it? No. Well, those guys should be in my sphere. Influence. I should probably make sure that my... Oh, actually, yeah, I'm at 100, so... Nothing there that is really that worrisome. Colonial education policy. Uh, far from... Let's see. We need to enact a more comprehensive education policy. I believe the resources should be better spent elsewhere. Gain two prestige. Gain research points. Gain point three literacy. Eh, it's not that many research points, and 2.2 .2 prestige is kind of nothing. Well, let's get the literacy. Yeah. Now, these guys are being influenced as well, right? Yep. With the 74... This is my sphere. Commanding got pulled out of my sphere. Um, I need to get them back in. Harder than influence this country. I could discredit them. How much does that cost? 25 of her influence. Let's go ahead and discredit Georgia. Just to make it harder for them to get points. So these guys are up to speed. Let's see, where can we sit them? We can sit them here. Let's move these guys over here. Can we recruit? Not a lot. Someone is tampering with our empire. It's no longer in our sphere of influence. Really?
Well, he'll be right back in my sphere of influence almost immediately. July 20th, okay. Uh, yep, we can bring them back into our sphere. I have to keep an eye on that. Alright. We're down to 16.78 infamy. We've got armies in the field. We have more armies under construction. We're being recruited. Artillery, artillery. Let's actually do this. Let's make you a rally point right there. Let's bring these um, artillery here and let's start recruiting infantry. Infantry. Do four infantry, one engineer, and some cavalry. There we go. Show empty states. Now, unemployed, yes, let's sort by unemployed craftsmen. Let's see. They have almost 3,000 unemployed craftsmen, and look at all of the... Well, they're all being upgraded, so... They should be okay. This is being upgraded. We got new stuff getting built here. Uh, what can we build here? Uh, where is that province even located? Guangxi, Guangdong. Okay. What's the RGO here? And actually, let's, um... Expand the railroad there. It's wood. Healthy local poor and silk. Lots of wood. Okay, so let's build some lumber mills. Um, let's build a lumber mill. Let's build a lumber mill. Oh, can't build a lumber mill. So let's build a furniture factory to use the lumber. This is what, silk? So that would be a luxury clothes factory. Let's build that there. Oh, our budget's all over the place. Projected daily balance. Yeah, well, we got a lot of work going on. Okay. I'm going to bring these guys down here as well, just to make sure that I don't accidentally end up using them. Uh, what's the... 
Insurance relations. Uh, my research complete. British Empire expands. Province of Iceland now belongs to the British Empire. Okay. Price of luxury clothes has steadily risen. Ah, finish the iron muzzle loaded artillery. Uh, when can we do this? In two days? There we go. At the very least, we're not letting them have it. Okay, so we need a new tech. Let's see, iron breech loaded artillery. I need iron steamers, 1860. It's from five years. Raider group doctrine. Fire control systems. Coal production output, sulfur production output, iron production output, coal mine size. Um, let's hit that. I think it'll be relatively quick. Literacy at the 46.6%. Well, one thing I do need to look through is our not our focuses that we were doing. Let's see, we got clerks. Clerks are still really low. And we were encouraging soldiers somewhere, if I remember correctly. Here. Soldiers are at 5%. Oh, let me just double check. Keep an eye on this. Uh, let's see, what does it say? October, okay. All right, I think, I think we are ready to give this a shot. I think we're ready to give this a shot. Why isn't there any cavalry in here? Uh, let's get some cavalry in there. Oh, major discovery, knight training. Clericalism versus anti-clericalism. Okay, get some plurality. Uh, I think I need to try to mitigate this a little bit. Let me push the tariffs up a little bit. It was all over the place, because we got all those factory expansions going on. So. Should be okay. Alright, do we want to give this a try? Oh, what's this? Soon. Okay, Asia. Uh, George is at 35. I want to get Kumania back into the sphere and then we'll, we'll then we'll mess with uh, Georgia. Uh, let's see. What was what? Shun? Yep. Add to sphere. There we go. So now these guys are in the sphere. Woo, are you in the sphere yet? Almost. You know what? Fortune favors the bold. We're gonna do this. Justify war. Add to sphere. No, not add to sphere. Acquire state. Yeah, acquire state. 
Justify the war. Who knows? Maybe we won't get discovered at all. Hoysley disturbed. Uh, who cares about their religion? Now, if anybody is going to go to war, that's going to be one of the great powers over here. So I think I want to take my ships and I want to move them back to the Mediterranean. Just in case. We have more than enough military force in this region to fight Lanshang. And if nobody else is willing to mess with us, then we'll just take them down. Right, so that's that should be sufficient. So let's go ahead and push these guys up to the front. Help feed the local poor. Let's bring these guys here. Go back to my recruitment mode. Oh, it's October. Add that in. We're going to run them out of points. I'm not sure we're going to win this. Oh well. Okay, so recruitment map mode. Recruitment map mode. We need more infantry, more infantry, more infantry, more infantry. Some engineers, some cavalry. And some cavalry. Oh, hold on. Let's go back over there. Uh, let's uh, turn that off as a rally point for the moment. And then build the cavalry there. Oh, our attempt to justify war using acquire state has been detected. And we are now at 25.79. Infamy. Now let's see if anyone thinks they've got what it takes. What I might actually do is take these armies. Well, it depends on who goes to war with us. We might need to shift some guys around. I think the biggest potential candidate is going to be Georgia. Because they're the most powerful great power next to me. Right? Actually, no. They're like way down here. What's their military strength? Soldiers and army. Capital ships. They have slightly better leaders. We have way bigger army than they do. Yeah, no one even comes close to the size of my army. Ooh, what's this? Ah, woo. Whoa, you're in the sphere. There you go. Anybody else give me any trouble? Everybody who's in my sphere. Anybody giving me any trouble with my spheres? Doesn't look like it. Looks like we're safe. Are you back in the sphere yet? No, not yet. How much would it cost to expel their advisors? 50 points. Major discovery, field fortification. Okay.
Yep, not looking like anybody wants a piece. Alright, and these guys are done. So let's go to my supply limit. Let's move them. Someone's talked to Ilva's behind her back. Oh, I'm gonna drop the cordial. Yeah, it looks like we're gonna have to basically fight them for it. Uh, key. Okay. They're in Asia. You guys, you get in the sphere. There we go. So, our sphere of influence now has everything but Ming. Where's Ming at? Almost there. And do I actually want to try and make an alliance with any of the other great powers? Who would be the best? Or the easiest? See, they have an opinion of 14, 3, negative 28, 0, 29, negative 62. Georgia has fallen off the grid. Who might... Fox might take Georgia's spot? They're an Aztec sphere. Oh, no, Georgia just switched back in. Uh, Georgia and Aztecs are swapping around. Oh, oh, we're losing. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get this. So we're never going to get it. Well... Oh, we'll make them burn all their colonial points doing it. I think the British Empire is going to be the best to... try to make as a, a great power ally. Go ahead and increase relations with them. Mania. News reaches us from Wu, the local ruling elites have thrown our ambassadors out of the country and that their troops are laying siege to our embassy with apparent intent to enforce that decision. Threat is developing to an enormous loss of internal face, one which can only be avoided through a formal declaration of war against Wu. By Jingo. Call allies, perhaps we'll let the Wu dragon sleep. Influence changed by negative 200. Here's the thing. Could I even get any troops to woo? Probably. UA's in my sphere. Ah, but we are justifying a war against... We'll lose prestige. Hmm. I could probably beat these guys with a single army. So we'll go. We'll go with this. Let's we'll start moving forces. Oh, we need military access. They will not accept. Anybody give us military access? We have no way of getting to them. I 
Actually, we do. Hold the phone. I have transports. Alright, let's get some guys over here. And oh, we're getting long. Okay. Uh... I should have more transports than that, don't I? Ah, yes I do. Okay, so we're going to go ahead, we're going to end this episode here. We'll deal with Wu. Um, we will deal with Lan Shang. And it looks like no one has the stones to declare war on me to try to contain my aggression. Which is fine by me. Alright, so hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment. And I will see you next time.